Hi, I'm Jason. I'm Abby. And I'm Lena, and we're here to tell you about a place we all love, Shriners Hospital for Children in Spokane. I've been coming to Shriners since I was about four years old. And I've been coming here since I was 11. And I've been a patient here for five years, and we are twins. This is the outpatient clinic where around 900 kids come each month. And the best part is, you don't have to stay overnight. And there's not only just one nurse and one doctor looking after you, but there's a whole team that's dedicated just to helping you. This is the pre-op room, where patients come before surgery. Your parents are here, the staff is very nice, and it's a very relaxing place. This is the casting room, and one of the many things they do here is um, fixing club foot. And um, they do this by putting it in a cast instead of doing surgery, and it's a lot less painful. I had Botox injections, and um, my foot was so tight that um, they ended up having to put me in a cast, and it helped relax the muscles, and I didn't need surgery after this. Physical therapists here in Spokane understand how kids think and feel. Here in this room, they help you relax and get your strength back so you can walk in a more effective way. Physical therapy can be hard work, but it can also be fun. You can get sometimes stressed, but in the end, you know it's worth it because you know you can walk better. We spent a week up here in intense therapy, and it was incredible. From the time I saw Abby leave to the time she came back, she was a totally different girl. Um, the therapy was incredible. This is the hydrotherapy pool, where many patients come each day. The best thing about it is it helps you feel relaxed because therapists help you stretch out and feel more comfortable in a safe environment. They have you do water exercises, work against the currents to build up your muscles, and you get exercise while you're also having fun. When I'm in the water, it actually makes me stand more with more balance and confidence because I'm not so wobbly because the water supports me. This is the occupational therapy room and it's used to help kids with their hand-eye coordination so they can button up buttons and zip zippers and put on socks and shoes and it teaches them to be more independent. Recreational therapy teaches coordination and teamwork. They have foosball, air hockey, video games, even toys for the little kids. They even have pets that come in and visit like golden retrievers and labs. Everybody loves them. There's even a cool place for teens to hang out and just be together. There's a transition camp where older teens can go away for a week without their parents and do things like job interviews and resume writing to help prepare you for college. And there's even a big dance at the end where you get to hang out with all your peers and just have a great time. Doctors know how upsetting a hospital stay can be, so they try to keep the rooms as cheerful as possible. And you don't have to worry about going to sleep at night because your parents can stay with you. And you can get a room service button. How awesome is that? You can get any food you want to eat. And if you can't go to sleep at night, you can have the snoozinator. This is the family center. Up to six families can stay while the child's in the hospital. They actually have a fold-out bed for the parents, and so uh, one parent can stay with them. And uh, We flip straws, but I'm shorter, so I fit the bed a little more comfortable. So <laughs> we sent him over to the house with um, Lena, and so it, it made it very comfortable for all four of us. And that was one thing that we had never experienced anywhere else, is the, the comfort that they made for the entire family. It wasn't just the patient. Um, so um, our child or child that wasn't having the surgery was just as included. This is the cafeteria where I can come to any time to find a bite to eat, even find a friend to talk to. And yes, the food is nutritious. Here we have the motion lab. It may just look like video games, but the truth is there's so much more behind it than that. Here they use motion sensors and help analyze and improve the way you walk. The surgeons and doctors use this information to see how you progressed after surgery. This is the x-ray room and they take pictures of your bones and it doesn't hurt at all. It just makes a sound and then they're done. And All the people are very nice and they take real good care of you and they always ask lots of questions before they do it and they make sure that you know what's going on ahead of time so that way you aren't so nervous. We'd love to have you come and visit us. Just call us and we'll set it up. Thank you for letting us show you the place we love. Bye! Bye.